y'all. Welcome back. I'm Tanya, aka Harold Sims, and this is episode two of our 100 Baby Daddy edition. As always, you can find the link to the challenge in the description. We are just waking up here. He had napped outside. She had napped in the bed. She's pregnant, so he gave her the bed. She is just cooking her a little bit of breakfast. I did switch out his aspiration to the painter extraordinaire, and since his needs aren't as bad as hers, we are gonna go ahead and get him to start on a classic painting this morning and then take care of his needs, uh, make sure her needs are good, and then I think we'll head out and see if we can find a baby mama number two. <laughs> real quick here. So let's get their morning stuff done real quick. All right, energy and hygiene I'm not too worried about. Let's take him to town. Let's get some drama going. We need at least one more pregnant mama. All right, we have arrived at the cafe. It is raining. Let's get inside. And I get that it's raining, but there's literally, there's no one here. But the bartender, um... Can I order some coffee uh, for here? Um, let's have a cappuccino. Can we do that, please? Hello. Let's give her a friendly introduction, too, once she gets over here. And friendly introduction. Oh, it's so dead at 9.30 in the morning. Oh, 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 here we go. Alessandra, friendly introduction. This is a sim that I created. All of my sims are in here, so you're going to see a lot of them and all their different personalities and traits throughout this. So let's get our coffee and see if we can work on baby mama number two here. Get that and come introduce to this young lady here. There we go. I clicked on it twice. All right, we've got that time. Let's ask about taste and decor, see if we can hit it off with her also. Describe a new idea. Talk about dreams. Um, brighten her day. Ask about taste and music. Um, share ideas. Yes. She likes mid-century decor. Okay. Oh, there's another one of my sons. Ask about taste in music. Um, oh, let's see if we can a friendly introduction to Camille while we're here also. Oh, we are just getting to know everybody right now. <laughs> oh my goodness. Um, no, we already did that. I'm losing her. Oh, we are surrounded. <laughs> oh my goodness. Y'all, we're surrounded by people right now. I've never had this happen. Ask about favorite color. Let's see what all we can get to know about her. Tell her funny stories that she's feeling playful. Propose a crazy scheme. Let's see what are their impressions of each other. Okay, let's see, she is active. We know that so far. We know that she dislikes lullaby music, uh-oh. She likes mid-century decor, they are acquaintances. His first impression is that she is responsible. Um, her first impression about him is he's cool. So we may have our second baby mama in the works here. We just gotta discuss neighborhood changes. We just have to keep chatting, can you? Introduce yourself to Camille, too. That way she's on our radar for later. Let's tell her another funny story. He's like, man, you know what happened the other day? <laughs> I was fishing, and mm, I about fell in the lake. <laughs> oh, my goodness, yes. <clears throat> oh. Okay, well, one of his whims just went through. Cool. Um, chat about property values. Um, let's ask about taste and music one more time. Do an impression. Oh, this is beautiful. It's beautiful. And she's so playful. 
All right, this is working out rather well. Ah, uh, deep conversation. Confess attraction. Let's see if she'll take that one. She's taking our flirts rather well. She is unemployed. Okay. Um, favorite color? Hobbies and skills. We want to know all about you because we're a gentleman. We are, we are, we are. Definitely a gentleman. Compliment outfit. Oh, she loves the outdoors. Perfect, because that's probably where you'll be sleeping. The inside of a joke. And then we are just seriously going to see what happens here and tr see if she will try for a baby with us. We want the drama. We want the drama. We're not actually anybody's boyfriend just because she back there is pregnant. Don't mean that. Like, come on, let's do it. Come on. Come on. Okay, did it not? Did it not pop up? Come on. Try for baby. Now let me do it because she's here. Oh, maybe it's because she wasn't actually on on the property. Now she is. Are we going to do it? Yes, we're going to do it. Let's do it. While the other one's sleeping. <laughs> oh my goodness. I'm horrible. I am horrible. All right. This episode seems to be just a pinch longer. Um, I didn't really want it to be a whole lot longer. All right. <coughs> do we have baby mama number two already? Do we? Do we? That is the question. He is so tired. It's 6 p.m. He needs to eat and sleep and shower and all that good stuff like very, very soon. And his hygiene is going down lower and lower in this bush. Well, we're not getting fireworks this time. So, come on, Alessandra. There they are. Yes. Beautiful. Fireworks, the second one. Oh my gosh, that's gonna be two kids a day apart already. All right. Okay, here they come. All right, let's pause that for just a minute. Pregnant, so we are going to ask her to move in, which she may not do. Ask her to join the household. Let's see if she'll join the household real quick and then we'll go take care of his needs. Come on, ask her to join the household too. Oh, she is feeling fine and dandy about herself. Oh yeah, she's active. Oh. <laughs> she's gonna be like, I, no, I'm, I'm not moving in with you after you just fell in the mud like that. <laughs> All right, let the drama commence. She is moving in too. We want just her, sorry, sorry guys. Oh, just her, no money. All right, y'all, I am going to end this episode there. We have two pregnant women in our household. Uh, something tells me that this is going to get extremely interesting, extremely quickly at this point. So we are going to just use the bathroom, have some food, take a bath, and we're going to get some sleep um, on our little bench that we like to sleep on here. And I guess what I'm going to have to do is um, enlarge this house already. Okay, so she's hungry and stuff too. So we'll see how that goes. This one's doing good. Yep. All right. We are going to end this episode here and I will see you in the morning on Tuesday for episode three and these two lovely women meeting each other and finding out that they are both pregnant by the same guy and they are both living in the same house with the said guy that got them both pregnant. And then we are going to take him out and try to find, wait, where's the fire? Where's the fire? 
Fire. A fire. Oh, no. Oh, extinguish. Oh, my goodness. Oh, oh. You clearly cannot cook on a grill, Alessandra. Oh, Lord, yes. Okay. Whoo. We're good. We're good. We're good. All right. We're good. Um, we cannot really replace it, but we're just going to replace it. And uh, all right, y'all. A little bit of drama ensued at the end of episode two. But anyways, like and subscribe. Hit your notification bell so that you know when the next episode is live. And I will see you in episode three. Bye.